What's up guys and welcome back to the channel today. I've just been into the specialist dealer. Um, I've trekked myself to the Mercedes AMG C63. Um, I thought we could see if we could do a little drift build on it. Um, let's, let's have a look. We, we want a bit more power out of it I believe. I don't know what it is stock. Let's have a look. Uh, what are we stock? 542 horsepower. And what have we got on it? There is no turbo on it at the moment. We've got a slap of turbo on it, haven't we? Let's have a look over here. Aspiration conversion. Ooh, what have we got? The twin turbo, the supercharger. Ooh, it's got to be the turbos. I just love the sound of turbos. Twin turbos, here we come. Ooh, look at the money going down. I've already skipped myself out a little bit buying this car. Really need to get into some more more races and do that. A bit of, uh, what bump? They're calling it the Mercedes bumper. Okay. Sweet, sweet. Can't see no nasty toe strap on this. Not like it used to be in Forza 3 with the bumpers. No, they're in. Oh, I like that. That's nice and subtle. We shall slap that on. And let's have a look at the spoiler. Ooh, do we keep the little lip spoiler? I think we keep the little lip spoiler. I like the little lip spoiler. We'll keep that on. Uh, tires. Let's have a little look. I like the stock rims. I think we'll, we'll keep the stock rings for now. And if we go, we got what we got. We got the sport tire compound on. Or we can keep the stock. On. Uh, let's keep it with the sports. We'll see. If, we'll see what we can do with the sports. Now the fronts we will keep at that whip. And we want a nice and wide at the rear so we can get some grip because I can imagine with this now being twin turbo is going to spin up like an absolute. Right, let's have a little look. Do some drive train upgrades here. We'll put the race clutch in. We'll put the nice race transmission in so we can mess it up with the gear ratio if need be. Race drive line. Well, so we've got diff. We need the diff. The race diff. Let's put the race diff on. There we go. And let's go back into suspension and brakes. we got to have the big, big brakes. We want to be able to stop. We want the suspension. We want to be able to drop it down low. Yes. And we shall stiffen her up a little bit. See, that's, that's already got... Already has the sports on it, but no, we want the race. We want to max it out on the suspension. No, no, I don't want. No, I don't want a full cage in it. We'll leave it. We'll leave it as that. We'll leave it as the sports sashi. The support sat. I can't even say sat. No, I'm not even going to try. We'll leave it as that. <laughs> right, and as weight, we will reduce the weight a little bit because she is a bit of a heavy thing. So we are sitting at 654 horsepower. I think that should be enough to get a spinning, but we'll, we'll put a few little mods. We'll, we'll put the breather mods, put the intake on there, give it some more fuel. Uh, do we want to do the spark plugs? Let's get them in. What else we've got? Oh, we've got to have the exhaust. Let's get the exhaust on there. As for cams, I think I'll leave the valves. I'm going to leave block and pistons. Don't think we're going to. See, we're already near 700. Should we push it all the way to 8? I think that's going to be too much to handle at 8. Oh, let's... Let, let's put the Sport. Let's put the Sport Twin Turbos on. We'll see. Let's put us to 761. Oh, it's taking us just over 800. I think we shall just put the Street in the corner on for now. That brings us to 771. Oh, what's happened? We've crashed. Oh, they still need to fix some bloody issues. Let's restart that. Right, and we're back. So I think we got up to the oil and cooling before we just crashed there. Like I say, I thought I thought this update they done today might have fixed this issue. It's only happened a couple of times to me, but it's really annoying. 
So right, let's go ahead and put the race flywheel on, and that gives us a total of 779. Oh, what the hell? No, nope, 779 horsepower. Let's see. Do we want to tweak anything just yet? Let's have a little look in here. A little hmm, alignment. Hmm, let's bring that front negative camber on the front a little bit over there. Anti-roll bars will leave. We'll leave uh, we'll drop it down low. Got to have it low. Drop it down low. And I think that'll do for just about now. And we'll, we'll see how she get on. Save and apply. Let's get over on into free play. I don't know where we're going to try it. Maple Valley? Yeah, we'll give her a go in Maple Valley. We'll see if we can get it to drift. Of the current so well, obviously you've just seen I haven't touched much in there but she might drift all right to start with we'll see here we go into the pits and we'll go straight into the test drive because obviously we may need to do a few adjustments to the tune-up we haven't really touched it as of yet but We'll see how it goes. Let's get on into this test drive. Oh, I didn't even check the assists. I think we can change that in here anyway. Oh, this thing is sounding absolutely beautiful. Loving it, here we go. Oh, and we're at odds. I skipped the gear. Let's just have a quick little look on the assists here. We want the ABS off. We want traction control off. Stability off. We'll keep that in manual. Let's have a little look. Oh my god, oh my god. No, we're. Oh, this thing has got so much power. Alright, let's get. Oh, we're going into rewind. Right, let's get out of that view. Let's see what the car is doing. Oh, listen at that thing. Let's have a little sound check. Oh! Absolutely beautiful, guys. Here we go. Oh, she's all over the shot. Mm, I think we're going to have to be doing some tweaking. Maybe, maybe not. No. Oh my God. That just spins. That just spins her up like anything. Even third. Oh my God. There's just no grip there whatsoever. Let's see if I turn in. Stability control on helps us a little bit. I do find that helps sometimes when we're trying to do these drift bar builds. Still in third gear and that just spins. I just think it's got too much power. I think we're going to have to go back and take some out. We'll see, we'll see. Come on. Oh my god, there goes the back end again. Ooh, hit the barrier there. Not going as well as I planned. I thought this would be quite an easy build. Oh, this no, 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 no. That's just so much power to them rear tyres. Right, let's get over. Let's get out of this test drive quickly, and we should go back. And we're going to take we're going to take the massive twin turbos off. I'm going to bring them down. We weren't really getting on with uh, the setup there, so what I've done is I've gone ahead and changed the tune up a little bit. And sorry. What's going on, guys? You could see that that weren't really going to plan. The, the tune on it was just not, not happening. So what I've done is I went back into the upgrades. We got rid of the, we got rid of the um, racing race tire compound, and we put it back to the sport tire compound. We're sitting at 712 horsepower now because we, we went for the middle turbo, didn't we? 
And then if we go over into the tomb, this is what I've done. I've left the tire pressures normal this time. The gearing, I think I've moved over, moved over to 2.7. So if you want to copy this, go ahead. Um, we'll put the negative camber to 3.5 on the front and 0.5 on the rear. Haven't touched the toe. We've touched on the front caster angle, obviously we've moved that to 6. Anti-roll bars we haven't touched. The springs, the only thing we've done here was drop the right height down low. Uh, we didn't touch the dampener. We didn't touch the down... Oh yes we did, we did touch the downforce and I've moved it back. I put it over to corner and what was happening was is when we were coming out of the drift, I think it was trying to grab too much grip and just chucking me the opposite way. So we've moved that down to 72. Then we've gone over to the braking force, we haven't touched it, and again for acceleration, we haven't touched it. So, now this time, I'm hoping we will be a little bit more successful. On on here, you can see in the assists, ABS is off, steering is normal, traction is off, stability is off. And we've got shifting is manual, damage is cosmetic, rewind is on, and friction assist is off. Right. Let's get back into this. Let's go onto that test track and see if we can get this thing to drift now. Here we go, guys, in the 6.3 litre twin turbo beast of an AMG. Can we make it drift this time? Oh, she just spins and spins. Let's drop it down to third. Hit that handbrake. Oh, come on. That's it. That's it. She's out. She's drifting. Oh, my God. Absolute animal. And we're still going. Oh, perfect. Can we make it? Oh, no. I was hoping to get through them two corners at the same time. But she is drifting now. Look at that. Perfect drift up in the top left corner there. Oh, absolute animal. This thing sounds amazing. There we go, a little bit there. Keep us steady. Here we go. This is a tricky corner. If you don't hit it right, you always lose it. Oh no, we've got it. We've got it. She's going for it. She's trying to chuck us out. We kept it. No, she wouldn't take it. There we go. She's still going. Oh my god, this thing is an animal! <laughs> oh, we nearly lost it off the track there. I don't know if she would go into full force. Yes! There she is. Oh, spinning it. Oh, pressed it up. I didn't want to go up. Stupid flappy paddles, we need to get rid of them, we need the shifter. Life will be, oh my god, we nearly spun it out, we saved it. We're still going, we're still going. Not the cleanest of drifts, mind you, but we haven't really got to grips with the car yet. She's still going. Oh my god, this thing is an animal. And the flames that chucked out of the twin exhaust seat side is just absolutely amazing. There she goes. Onto the home stretch. Oh my god, I love this thing. This is going to be one of my favourite drift cars, or, or high end drift cars will go. We'll say high end drift cars. Oh, on the downshift. Can she kick it out? She's kicked it out. There she goes. Oh, what an animal. She just goes and goes. Oh, a bit more of an angle. There we go. Just touch the grass there. Can we bring it round? Don't lose it. Oh, no, and we're off. I think we're going to have to tweak the settings a little bit with her. But, oh, she is an animal. We've hit the barrier. Well, there it is, guys. We've done the AMG C63 build. Absolute amazing car. The sound of it is just phenomenal. But if you do like this video, please hit that like button and subscribe button for more. I'll see you next time.